So in this tutorial, we will learn about quote function. So what is quote function and what does it do? So let's understand everything one by one with examples. So first, what is code? So type here equal to code and click here. We got the insert function dialog box and here you can see it returns a numeric code for the first character in a text string in the character set used by your computer. That means it will return a code for a text string. So it will return a numeric code for the first character of the text string that you specify. So if you type here A, sorry, within quotation A, you can see it is 97. But if you type here Apple, it's also 97 because it returns the numeric code for the first character only. So let's see type here equal to code and select capital A then bracket close enter we got 65 and drag this we can see that as we have learned the character function in the character function it returns a character from the code and here it's opposite it returns the code from the character tip type equal to code enter you can see we have already understood in the character function that 65 stands for capital A and 97 stands for small a now here equal to code select a text string and press enter you can see it gives the character code for the first character that is here we have an ox but it returns only the character code for capital a you can see here it's 65 for n it is 109 for small a it's 97 in this way it returns all this here we are going to hash king so 35 is the character code for hash and here for the character code 1 is 49 to 50 now here again type here code select this and bracket close enter so you can see these are the character codes for these characters so in this way you can convert a character or a string into a character code so I hope you have understood the code function very clearly but still if you have any problem write me in the comment section. I will upload this practice file you can download it from the description box. If you like this video please hit the like button and share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe our channel so that you can get regular notification and updates from our channel when we upload new excel videos. Thanks for watching the video till the end. See you soon in the next tutorial.